Welcome to Liberated Stock Trader. Learn stock market investing. My name is Barry Moore, Certified Financial Technical Analyst and Founder of LiberatedStockTrader.com. In this episode, I'll cover the topic of How to Learn Stock Trading, 27 Steps to Success. In this episode, I'll be using a page on our website at www.liberatedstocktrader.com forward slash learn minus stock minus trading. There you'll find the interactive guide used as the core of this episode today. So Liberated Stock Trader is dedicated to helping you learn stock trading and investing for your future so you can take control of your investments. There is a wealth of information available on this website and others across the internet. But where do you start? What is your plan to learn stock trading? So my stock trading plan is a fun interactive guide from the knowledge you need via training courses, books, movies, to the end, which is executing your trading plan and building your wealth over time. There are essentially eight key areas of learning, building, and executing your system that we're going to cover today. The first of the core steps is to get educated, and this can include coaching, free training, professional training, books, movies, and even audiobooks. Second area we're going to cover today is choosing your analysis tools, so the tools of the job. Are you going to use free stock charting tools, pro software, which stock screening tools will you use? The third core step is to prepare your strategy. So what is going to be your approach to the market itself? Next, we're going to take a look at choosing a vehicle. So what vehicle are you going to use as part of your investment plan, such as stocks, exchange traded funds? What vehicle are you going to use as part of your investment plan, such as stocks, exchange traded funds, options, binary options, CFDs, etc.? Next, we'll take a look at choosing a broker. What kind of broker do you want to go for? Discount or advisory brokerage? Then we'll have a look at executing a trading plan, how to review the market, analyze and improve your system itself. And finally, build your wealth and enjoy. Okay, let's move to step one. Step one, get educated. The first step on the path to becoming a competent stock trader and investor is education. There are many training courses available, both free and premium training packages, ranging from hundreds of dollars to thousands of dollars. Your trading will need to encompass both fundamental analysis and technical analysis. We have a guide on the site called Choose Trade Stock Experience at Stock Screening, Company Selection, Portfolio and Money Management and the Psychology of Trading. So that's a big mouthful. So let's take a look at some of the free options we have. So everyone wants something for free. So here it is. Liberated Stock Trader has a large free training course, the Trading Academy, with hundreds of lessons and videos. It includes our structured 18 module course 101, Understanding the Stock Market, with an online test at the end. That's all completely free. You can register for it at the website. There are also options for professional level stock trading courses. So alternatives to free courses include courses that are either in person, in a seminar setting or online training. Often premium courses will include video lessons and email support. Going for a premium course will typically help you learn faster and have a much higher quality help you learn faster and have a much higher quality of content so you can save time and effort by getting the best first. I've had students write to me asking me, is $30,000, $40,000 for a training course a reasonable amount to ask? I'll be clear now, it's not. It's way too much for a training course on stock market investing or trading. That is way out of the league and you need to be careful of that. So for example, the Liberated Stock Trader Pro course is a print edition book plus an ebook with 16 hours of online video lessons and a private members group for Q&A and working with your peers. And it is a fraction uh, of that cost. Another option you can use is to utilize coaching. So you can get personal stock trading coaching. 
You need to... No, just joking. Personal investing coaching is a good option to help cement your existing experience and test out strategies and plans. The best thing is that the training experience is usually customized to you and your needs. For example, with coaching, you can analyze the stocks you like, learn advanced concepts aligned to your trading style, you learn about market direction evaluation and practice it. You can bounce your ideas off an expert, apply advanced stock screening to find great stocks, and even work together on formulating your own trading plan. So they're formalized training courses or, and coaching, but there is a wealth of great books, great movies, and even audio books you can utilize to expand your knowledge and increase your uh, experience. Step five, read a great book or 20. With thousands of books to read, where do you great book or 20? With thousands of books to read, where do you start? At Liberated Stock Trader, we have the top 20 best stock market investing books all reviewed. This review also includes 14 books that pro market technical analysts use to study to qualify for the International Federation of Technical Analysis or CMT Chartered Market Technician exams. These are industry recognized certifications. We have it all covered from the all time bestsellers to academic studies. So here, for example, let me list some of my favorite books. So How to Make Money in Stocks by William O'Neill. It's a great starter book for beginners new to investing. I also like Trade Like a Stock Market Wizard by Mark Minervini. Winning on Wall Street is an absolute classic that uh, needs to be read. Technical Analysis Explained is literally the Bible for technical analysts covering charts and indicators, supply, demand, volume, uh, 60, 600 pages of detailed technical analysis. Another Wall Street classic is One Up on Wall Street. This is an absolute must read. And the final one I'll just touch upon today is The Little Book of Common Sense Investing. This book will give you perspective on the difference between learning to trade and investing for the long term. Because you need to establish where you're going to go before you start investing or trading. So The Little Book of Common Sense Investing by John C. Bogle is a must read. That's also available on Audible. In terms of pro-technical analysis books, some of, the, some of the key best books that are used to study as part of the core curricula of the IFTA, CFTE or CMT exams are The Technical Analysis of Financial Markets by John J. Murphy, Technical Analysis Explained by Martin J. Pring, and Technical Analysis, The Complete Resource for Financial Market Technicians. Now these are some seriously thick hardback books that are impossible to read from beginning to end. You use them as key reference books to expand your knowledge and to study the art slash science of technical analysis. Another great way to learn is to watch a great financial market movie or a Wall Street movie. If you sit in front of a computer all day and read books in bed, what do you do in your downtime during the evening? Why not watch a financial thriller, stock market movie, or a true story? Sit back with your feet up and convince your partner to watch a film. Perhaps The Wolf of Wall Street for entertainment value or Boiler Room. Or my favourite movie, which is The Inside Job. This is such a great movie and it really is a movie I highly recommend you watch. Matt Damon's the narrator. It's won multiple awards, including an Academy Award for Best Documentary. And it's really about the start of the financial crisis in 2007, what built up to it, who was negligent, and it is absolutely gripping. And it even has a great music score. There are also hundreds of audio books available. So if you're bored of reading, if you have too much energy to sit down and watch a stock trading movie, why not listen to a great book while commuting or gardening or out walking the dog? This really 
Stack walking the dog. This really stacks up and multitasks your time. We have a review of the top 20 best stock market and finance audio books, which has some cracking listens, such as the highly rated Flash Boys by Michael Lewis or the Quants by Scott Patterson. Fill your day with learning whilst not being chained to your desk. This is exactly what I do, and I have over 300 audio books racked up that I've listened to over the past few years. Now let's move on to the next core area, which is choosing our analysis tools. So there are many options available to help you analyze the markets. As with many things in the connected world, you will have access to cost-free offerings for stock chart analysis. There are some very respectable free offerings, but if you want real power and extended functionality, then the premium offerings are the right choice as tools. Free stock analysis charting tools. They may not have all the bells and whistles compared to their pay for competitors, but they are good for starters and will not put a dent in your wallet or purse. We have a review called the 10 best free stock charting services on the web, where we compare 290 different factors over 10 services and we declare two winners. Now in this comparison, we take a look at TradingView, which I highly recommend, Free Stock Charts, which is a great free stock charting package. And we also cover Stock Charts, Reuters, Yahoo, CNN Money, Google Finance, MSN Money, AOL Finance, and Finviz also. So we have an extremely detailed review. You can jump over to Liberate Stock Trader and you can read the free stock charting software review. Step 10 in the list is the premium stock market analysis software. So you are now progressing your knowledge and your knowledge and experience in the market and realize there are key features you need for your stock trading analysis, such as backtesting or powerful charts, specific indicators, real-time data and real-time streaming news. But which packages are the best for you? It really depends on your trading style, how you want to invest and what your trading or investing time frame is. So we've sorted through the many high quality and low quality stock analysis software vendors to bring you our in-depth review of the top 10 stock market analysis software programs. Now, there are many different winners for each section. This is formulated in seven different rounds of testing. Suffice to say, some of the recommended tools are for example trading view tc2000 for our american and canadian investors also metadata most recommended and they're recommended for specific scenarios and what your requirements are now let's take it to third core section which is formulating your investment strategy so how will you approach the market what will you invest in and when will you invest and why you need to form a consolidated stock trading strategy blueprint. There is currently a lot to consider when building out your investment strategy. There are core questions such as, should you use a day trading strategy versus a buy and hold strategy? Is value investing like Warren Buffett for you? Or is the more time and nerve intensive swing trading more your style? What is certain is that you'll need to be able to spot and avoid stock market crashes and be able to establish your trading rules based on your stock trading style. Also, advanced traders will want to ensure their system is backtested, meaning ensure their system is backtested, meaning it has worked in the past. Finally, if you're trading the earnings announcements or your stocks are susceptible to news-based price swings, you may want to choose a real-time high quality news provider. So these are specific articles that are linked from the webpage that I mentioned before, which is liberatedstocktrader.com forward slash learn minus stock minus trading. And we have articles on how to avoid stock market crashes, formulating trading rules, systems back testing, and how to select good news sources. So let's take a quick look at avoiding stock market crashes. Ensure you have a strategy to avoid the next stock market crash. A stock market crash is an unfortunate and historically inevitable part of trading, as are tsunamis to the natural world. Just like tsunamis, stock market crashes devastate those involved. 
devastate those involved. Prepare yourself for the next stock market crash by understanding the triggers and warnings that can be seen through technical analysis. So using charts, supply, demand, volume, price patterns, and having an understanding of the overall business climate. How to Avoid the Next Stock Market Crash is a publication from The Liberated Stock Trader. This book will help you protect your investments and give you a proven back-tested strategy to help you. Okay, next, establishing your trade rules. What chart indicators will you use? Under which conditions will you buy a stock? When will you sell a stock? Why did you buy the stock? And are those reasons still true? So many questions here. And here are some of the answers. These are all known as trade rules. If you establish your criteria for buying, holding and selling a stock before you buy and selling a stock before you buy that stock, then it can help you take the emotion out of a trade. We have an article called 10 Steps to a Professional Stock Market System. Emotions are your worst enemy. You must treat your investment decisions with a dose of logic not a slice of gut feel. This is when backtesting comes to the rescue. So systems backtesting. Perform a stock trading systems backtest. You may understand your reasons for a particular trade, but over the long term, does your hypothesis make money? An untested hypothesis is not worth the paper or screen it's written on. This is what's called backtesting. An example of backtesting is the stock market crash detector, which was mentioned before. This system focuses on trying to predict a stock market crash. There are numerous elements, stock price fluctuations and price versus specific indicators. It helps you to understand which of the many indicators, such as relative strength index, RSI, balance of power, BOP, moving average convergence and divergence, MACD, any of these, which ones actually work in a real world environment in the past. Of course, while past performance is no indicator of future performance, you can see statistically over thousands of trades what has worked and what has not worked. If you want backtesting, read our top 10 stock market software review and look at the section systems and backtesting to find a suitable product for you. Next, select new sources. If you want to stay in touch with macro or microeconomic events that you feel would may impact the market or your investments, then you're going to need a good source of news. Trading the news is a strategy some people adopt. There are many good sources of news for you to look at, such as Reuters, or sources of news for you to look at, such as Reuters, or Bloomberg, or Investors Business Daily, as the newspaper, for example. So if you trade the news, you want news delivered real time and that might cost. If you, for example, purchase a premium software package such as Metastock, you will get Thomson Reuters real time financial news integrated into that package as part of the cost of the monthly payment or yearly payment for Metastock. So if news, macro and microeconomic and business news is important to you, Metastock is certainly something to take a look at. Let's move on to choosing a vehicle. So choosing an investment vehicle. So why does Wall Street call them vehicles? Well, perhaps they want it to sound complex or fancy, or perhaps it's a reference to the transportation of your money to another. Stock investments can be seen as a car. Some stocks are Lamborghinis, fast and exciting yet inefficient, while others are a Toyota Prius, practical, not pretty, but efficient and safe. Binary options and contracts for difference are like riding a Ducati Panigale R, a great rush requiring huge amounts of concentration and ultimately risky. Exchange traded funds, ETFs, are like a bus. They are cheap, reliable and ultimately get you to where you want to go without any effort on your part. The ETF bus is a good place to be. You never have to worry about beating the market. You're always performing at the market with a minimum of effort and minimized tax implications. The book Unshakable by Tony Robbins lays out this argument beautifully 
as does the little book of common argument beautifully, as does the little book of common sense investing by John C. Bogle. Stock options are fairly complex calculations based on time and price, perhaps could be called a segue. Mm, I think I may be taking the analogy too far now. Okay, so let's move on. Step 17, trading stocks versus exchange traded funds. If you pick the right stocks, your returns can be excellent, but picking the best at the right time can be extremely challenging. What about index tracking exchange traded funds, ETFs? What are they? How do they compare? Next step, 18, trading stock options. Options were designed as risk protection, but they can be used for profiting greatly, providing you focus intensively on strategy and execution. There are two books in our top 20 stock market investing books review focused on learning stock options by Michael C. Thompson. And the next one is the Bible of Options Strategies by Guy Cohen, both great books. And I consider them compulsory reading before you enter the fray. In addition, on the website, we have a top 10 tips for stock options success with a video which is worth checking out. Trading in binary options and contracts for difference. Both binary options and CFDs, contracts for difference, are strictly for advanced investors and involve elevated levels of risk. If you want to take your money for a ride on the Ducati Superbike, then this dangerous and risky path is for you. You really need to know what you're doing, especially as most of it involves leverage and that you're not actually investing in the underlying asset. It's an abstraction of the underlying assets using what happens in terms of the asset valuation in terms of the asset valuation in the real market as a basis for whether you're going to get uh, paid or not so be careful there don't blow up your future investment pot a portion only a small percent of your investment pot to forex foreign exchange and contracts for different cfd trading Okay, next, let's take a look at choosing a broker. Do you live in the past or in the future? In the past, where access to the stock market was limited to a stock broker who would call you on the phone to convince you that the latest hot stock was worth investing in and you would believe him, see the film Boiler Room in the movie list, the future is the world we live in now, whereby you can research thousands of stocks instantly, see news and earnings, see the past performance of the company and execute your trades online for a minimum cost. So let's take a look at discount brokers. As a liberated stock trader, you should be in control of your own decisions. Choosing a broker means selecting those that minimize cost and enable good market access. Some good brokers are TradeStation, Ali Invest, TD Ameritrade, and numerous others. And there are many resources out there to give you some guidance on a discount broker. Advisory brokers. Make no mistake about it. Advisory brokers make money when you execute a trade. This means they will always be recommending that you sell a particular stock and buy another one. They make most of their money on the trade costs and not on any profit you make. Because the transaction cost is guaranteed and the future profit of a particular investment is not. Your best interests are irrelevant to them. Make your own decisions and minimize your costs with a discount broker. There are no recommendations for further reading under the advisory brokers section. So now let's see under the advisory brokers section. So now let's take a look at executing your trading plan. The second last of the core areas. Investing is a business, not a hobby. Continual improvement and adaptation is key to success. All of these factors are covered in our Liberated Stock Trader Pro Training at liberatedstocktrader.com forward slash pro. However, let's take a look at some of the key things you need to understand. You need to be able to review the market trend and direction and establish which direction the market is heading in and trade in that direction. The direction of the market will overall, although some companies are so large, like Facebook, Amazon, Apple, Microsoft, that their direction might influence the direction of the market, at least for a short period of time. When there is a market collapse, all stocks fall. 
even the good ones. When there is a rampant bull market, even the worst stocks rise. So what's the lesson? Well, you can use Dow theory to assess market direction using the major indices. We have numerous examples of how to use Dow theory and it's discussed in depth in the pro training. There are even advanced charts such as Ichimoku clouds to try and predict market direction as well. Ultimately, the stock market crash detector system, which I discussed earlier, can be used also to detect the direction, the overall direction of the stock market. So let's take a look at analyze and improve. So you have a system and it works. It's good practice to, to always check, back test and continually try to improve it. But make sure that change to your system is an improvement and does not increase risk and reduce reward. Okay, we're nearly there. Let's look at building wealth and compounding. So now you've done the hard work, you've learned, you have your preferred analysis software, you've built your rules and executing them. How do you become a millionaire? What percent return can you expect? How long will it take? All of these questions and more are answered in our guide to becoming a stock market millionaire. And this is covered in very much depth in the Liberated Stock Trader Pro Training. Suffice to say, if anyone approaches you via email, via a phone call, via a blog post, and tell you that you can make 10, 20, 30, 40, 50% a week or a month, then this is a, this is a whether they are intensive day traders or long-term investors, the realistic yearly average you can expect over a long period of time, if you're as good as Warren Buffett himself or George Soros, is approximately maximum 25% a year. And that 25% a year is more than the stock market itself, which fluctuates really between 7, 8, 9, 10% per year in the good bull market years. So be careful of wolves dressed in sheep's clothing offering you the chance to get rich quick. It doesn't exist. So analyze and improve and continue to do that and execute your strategy. And finally, enjoy. And finally, enjoy. So who am I to tell you how to enjoy life? No one, that's who. How you enjoy your life is down to you. Money is not everything and wealth is a matter of perspective. You are rich if you have a family that loves you, a dog that loves you, a partner that you have a connection with, or even if you have contentment in your heart. I wish for you to be healthy, wealthy and wise. I hope this episode has been useful and you enjoyed it. If you want a complete stock market investing education combining fundamental and technical analysis, risk and portfolio management to give you the knowledge to invest with consistency and confidence, check out our pro training with 16 hours of video and the Liberate Stock Trader book. Go to liberatedstocktrader.com forward slash pro. And don't forget, we have free introductory courses and very low cost courses as well at liberatedstocktrader.com forward slash register to your future.